In this video, we are going to learn how to solve problems involving length of arcs and chord of a circle for your jam mass. So we are going to practice with 5 repeated questions in this video. So let's get started with the first question I have here. It says, this first one here says, calculate the length of an arc of a circle of diameter 14 cm which subtends an angle of 90 degrees at the center of the circle. Alright, now, basically all you need for this kind of question is to apply the formula for finding the length of arc. So, for the length of arc, the formula is theta over 360 times 2 pi r. Alright, so in this question, theta is 90 degrees and our r would be diameter divide 2. So, which will give us, when you divide 14 by 2, you're going to have 7 cm. Alright. In the question, if you're not giving the radius, but you're giving the diameter, to get the radius, divide the diameter by 2. Alright, so let's plug in the values. It's going to be 90 degrees over 360 degrees times 2 times. Now, they are making use of pi in the option, so let's just write pi. We are using 22 over 7. 2 times pi times the radius is 7 over 1. Alright? So let's punch everything together on the calculator. So this is the jam calculator we're going to see. We have 90 times, let's simplify the numerator, 90 times 2 times 7. Okay? All the output, divide this by 360. So we have it to be what? 3.5. Alright? So 3.5 is something as 7 over 2. Let's verify. So we have 7 divide 2. 3.5. So the correct option will be option C. When you add this pi, it will be 7 over 2 times pi, which will give you 7 over 2 pi. So it's as simple as this. That's it for this question 1. Let's wipe this now and solve the next repeated question. Okay, so let's wipe this. Alright, so the next repeated question I'm going to solve will be this question. We have a chord of a circle of radius 7 cm is, is 5 cm from the center of the circle. What is the length of the chord? Alright, so guys, just like the first question we solved, for this question, to find the length of a chord, all you need is a right formula. The right formula for getting the length of a chord, we have it to be 2 square root of the radius square of the radius minus square of the distance of the circle all right so this distance for distance so basically in this question we have the radius to be 7 cm we have the distance to be 5 cm so when you plug in the values you are going to have 2 square root of radius is 7 square minus 5 square the distance so when you simplify you are going to have 2 square root of 49 minus 25 all right so let's break this down with the calculator so we have 49 minus 25 so we have 24 so now pay attention here guys we are left with 2 square root of 24 now you apply your knowledge of salt to simplify this expression to do this, under we can express square root of 24 is this is the same thing as root 4 times 6. Alright, you can choose to separate the square root. This will give you root 4 times root 6. Now, square root of 4 is 2. So, this will give you, when you join it with these two we have here, we're going to have 2 times, the square root of 4 is 2 root 6. So, four, 2 times 2 is 4. The final output will be 4 root 6. Alright, so CM. That will be the answer to this question. The correct option is what option B. 4 root 6. Alright, so that's it for this question. Let's wipe this now and solve the next repeated question I have for this video. Okay, so let's wipe this. Alright, so the next repeated question I'm going to solve will be this question. So, in this question it says, a circle has a radius of 13 cm with a chord 12 cm away from the center of the circle. 
calculate the length of the cord so it's still the same formula we're going to apply length of cord we have two square roots of square of the radius of the radius minus square of the distance so in this question we have a radius to be 13 cm we have the distance of the cord to be d equals 12 cm okay so when you plug in these values in the formula you're going to have two square roots of the radius is 13 square minus 12 square this is the same thing as two square roots of now 13 square is 169 minus 12 square is 144 four. so what you do now will be to subtract 144 four from 169 so it will be 169 minus 144 four. all the output we have it to be 25 okay so basically we have two square roots of 25 square root of 25 is 5 so this will give us 2 times 5 which will give us what 10 cm that will be the answer to this question the correct option is option a all right so let's wipe this now and solve the next repeated question all right so the next repeated question we are going to solve will be this question okay now guys before we solve this question if you are new to our channel ensure that you are subscribed to this channel for more of these videos we really appreciate this guys so let's go ahead and solve this question the question says in the circle above we center o and we do 7 cm find the length of the arc a b when angle a o b equals 57 degrees so basically all you need is to apply the formula for finding length of arc which is theta over 360 degrees times 2 pi r so in this question we have the theta to be 57 degrees we have the radius to be 7 cm so it's going to be 57 degrees over 360 degrees times 2 times now in this question they uh they didn't leave the options in pi so basically we know that pi is something as 3.142 okay let's just leave it at two decimal places 3.14 then times the radius is 7 all right over 1 so let's punch this on the calculator to see what's going to give us so let's simplify the numerator this is 57 all right times 2 times 3 point one four times seven all right let's divide this by three sixty this divide three sixty so we have the output to be what six point nine six so basically the correct option will be option d six point nine seven all right cm so that's the correct option this question is as simple as this so lastly let's solve the next question and after it we can call it a class let's write this all right so the last question i'm going to solve will be this question it says a cord is drawn 5 cm away from the center of a circle of radius 13 cm calculate the length of the cord so as usual you apply the formula the formula for calculating the length of a cord we have it to be 2 square root of square of the radius minus square of that the distance all right so in the question we have the radius to be 13 cm we have the distance to be 5 cm so when you plug in the values in the formula here we're going to have two square roots of the radius is we have 13 square minus 5 square so this will give us two square roots of 169 minus 25 so let's punch this on the calculator to simplify we have 169 minus 25 144 so we have two square root of 144 and we know that square root of 144 is 12 so the final result will be 12 times 2 could you give us what 24 
cm that will be the length of cord for this question so it's as simple as this this is basically how you can do problems involving length of cord and of a circle and length of arc of a circle for your jammer these are repeated questions with practice with so hope you learned something interesting from this video let's go into video here, guys if you are new to this channel once more ensure that you are subscribed to this channel for more of these videos also like share and comment on this video to tell me how you feel from what you learned from this video if you seem to have any specific question to ask regarding what i've talked about this topic how to find length of cord and length of arc of a circle feel free to leave your question in the comment section below and i'll be sure to give you a response now i click on the screen above and i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching